Khloe Kardashian. Let's talk been, about it. Did you more. see her photo? Don't yeah. show the photo because her lawyers will copyright it down wondering, this video. <laughs> I was wondering if I should show the Is photo. That real? Did they really copyright the photo and are taking it down over it? That's so weird. Okay, let me. T- so if you guys didn't hear Khloe Kardashian, her na- her like ninety year old nana, yeah. took like a candid photo of her and posted it on Instagram, and um. And she's, she looks norm like a normal body in it, not like a freak Kardashian well, all, body. No, she her body is lipo for the gods, and un- that's lipo. Oh, is it? She's had like liposuction after liposuction. It's you can like tell? you can tell, you can tell. That's a lipoed body for sure. It does look a little odd. And she's had her butt done in, and you can see before photos. Now look at her face. Now her face. Are you sure? Oh, you're not gonna. Okay, her face. They can't like see a, this by the what, way. Okay, right. Her face in this photo looks like an old Chloe face, meaning like her face when she was younger, maybe like five years ago. She has had a lot of work done since then. And she photoshops a lot of it, whatever. Or not not work, um, Photoshop, I mean, since then. And so, like, it looks like her old Chloe face that she doesn't want people to see anymore. And it's like, that's what she looked like. And she looks good. And everyone was saying it. Everyone was like, right. wow, she looks so good. Right. I think it was more shocking because that looks like an old Chloe face that we haven't seen through the filter. So everyone's like, wow. And she looks so pretty. She looks so much more youthful and, like, glowing there. Now, she then posts, like, was like, all the people were, like, trying to get these photos removed off the internet. It's still there. I mean, it's, like, easy to find. You can't ever get rid of this. You can't ever get rid of it. She's... And then what, but it was, okay, whatever, that's fine. But then what pissed me off is she did her reaction on her Instagram. She posted like her, a video of her like flexing her Super stomach. Super six packed out. Yeah, shit. she's just like, that this I is can my show. body yeah. that I worked hard for. First of all, you've all lipoed it. Like you've all lipoed your body. Here's the video. Or, I don't know if this is too graphic. I don't think so. Oh, they'll, they'll tell us because she's like kind of naked. But. Like you got- okay. oh. Anyway, but like I saw the I real candid. The fa- can you mute Dan? I saw the candid photo of you. I mean, and it's like you kind of look the same. Like your face is. I think that my my thing was her face. How different she looked. Like she face tunes a lot, and her face is hidden in this video. Then go to the next one. She's showing this. She's like, okay, look at my body. Like just trying. She obviously screams insecurity, trying to show people how flat her stomach is. Which again, that's a it's a body by lipo. You can see before and after. It's a body. And yes, you have to work hard to maintain the lipo. That's not like the thing. But it's like this would have been the perfect moment to be like, hey, yeah, we set unrealistic beauty standards that even we can't achieve. Yeah. So that's what I wanted. Like that's all you had to say. This was like the perfect time to be like. That's, that's always been my why I dislike the Kardashians is because, dude, there's. They're ruining the perception of a whole generation of women, what they should that they are like the leading cause of depression amongst like teenage girls. Yeah. And it's, it's I think if they were to say like Kylie denies getting lip filler. Right. And it's so obvious when you look at pictures of her mm. like two years prior to her being 17, 15 to 17. Dude, that, it's all like, of them have so much work. So much if work. If you look at the before <laughs> and after, like they, Kim Kardashian, Chloe had so much work and it's like, <laughs> and once I found, found that out that like someone, someone that worked for them told me, oh yeah, they get liposuction, which I had no idea as like a young girl. I got liposuction at 21. I was like, that's all you need. And guess what? My body changed completely too. It's like, if you're just honest about it, I think it's like a lot better. But these girls think that like they, they have to do all these squats to have a butt like you. And in reality, you just go to a doctor. Like, Dude, have you seen like these photos of like Kim's butt like in the wild? Yeah. It just looks like it's crazy. Wild, bro. Anyway. But it's their face too. And it's like, you know, you can't just say it's a workout. Like you changed your whole face. And the. I didn't even recognize that that was Chloe in that last video. In the. Right. That doesn't like, even I don't like follow her. on that closely, but I remember what she used to look like. I used to. Uh, I used to serve her all the time. Can I show that? You did? I worked at a restaurant and she used to come in. Oh. She was a fairly regular customer. Oh. She was actually really sweet. Um, yeah, they she was seem, always really nice. They seem nice, but why but, are they um, so hell bent on like? Yeah, well, I think they're yeah they're. It's they like have serious body image. She also problems. Had, yeah, she had a baby. She's close to forty. Like it's not like people are expecting. Can I you. show this? I've just been wondering. Like first of all, I don't know. From a from a fair use standpoint, I think I'm good because like. Um, it's newsworthy. I also don't think. But that, also, yeah. is it because it's a not a public photo that she doesn't want out there? So there's that aspect. I don't think I'll show it, but you can find it easily. And everyone was saying she looks great. No one was like That's shaming her. Thing, everyone yeah. was like, "Wow, this is amazing." To you see look what like they a really real person. Like. A real person. And then they're like, "Oh my god, get that taken down." F- <laughs> exact. I, I, it, it left a very bitter taste in my mouth. It's they've so been sad. like super fucking um, aggressive with the taking down of this photo everywhere. Even to the, the response point where, was super aggressive. Like everyone is calling me the fastest. They're like, "I'm not allowed to be insecure because I'm rich." It's like it's not about that. It's just about being she, honest. Wait, she said that. I didn't even read it. Yeah, she had it in her Instagram post. She had like a paragraphs of stuff, and it just being so defensive and. It's like, oh, here's her just statement. Just be honest. Like, it's just so not. Dude, you guys like it's literally owe it to people to show your real body because that's like the best thing you can do for the health of 
people right now. Yeah. Or wait. she, you know what she should have done in this wait, situation? Wait. She should have posted the photo herself and be like, oh. yeah, this is me. Like, oh, I don't know. Like, own it. Like, she it's says, so crazy. Hey guys, this is me and my body unretouched and unfiltered. <laughs> The photo that was posted this week is beautiful, but as someone who has, so why are you going <laughs> after literally everybody who even like, like everybody on YouTube is scared to show it. Like I was, when I was doing research for this, I was like, has anyone on YouTube shown the photo? Because I'm don't know if I should or not. Mm -hmm. And like Philly D and he showed it? no, he didn't. <laughs> Nobody showed it. So yeah. So cause they're, cause they're afraid. Right. But she's saying it's beautiful. Why didn't you post then it, why can't I, Yeah, <laughs> She says, this photo is beautiful, yeah, beautiful. But as someone who has struggled with body image her whole life, when someone takes a photo of you that isn't flattering and bad lighting or doesn't capture your body the way it is after working so hard to get it to this point, and then shares it. To, but your your body looked fine. Yeah. Bad lighting. And even if it didn't, like, everyone's telling you it did. No one's coming for you and saying, like, wow, also, you're disgusting. Like, you let yourself go. How many, like, dude, I'm sorry, but you're, like, the biggest public figure in the world. Like, people are always following you and taking photos. <laughs> yeah. Like, well, well, why this one is the one that all of a sudden, oh, I have to make this uh, philosophical stand. Unless it was all for publicity and get people talking about her because, I mean, it worked. But I don't know. Like, it seems so odd. I don't think in a good way. Everyone's like, Ugh. So she says, you should have every right to ask for it to not be shared regardless of who you are. In truth, the pressure, constant ridicule, and judgment my entire life to be perfect and meet other standards of how I should look has been too much to bear. <laughs> Chloe is the fat sister. Chloe is the ugly sister. Her dad uh, must not be... Her real dad because she looks so different. Oh, people think her dad is OJ or some shit. I know there's like <laughs> I don't a know conspiracy. About that one, yeah. No, that is true. The conspiracy. It's not true. No, it's not true. Right. Hello, Twitter world. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Chloe. <laughs> um, the only way she could have lost that weight must have been from surgery. Hmm, that's what you said. That's just what it is. Should you know I go on? Being a personality, you're making. Yeah, she has more pages. She has. You oh, make Jesus. so much money, like for people talking about you. Like that's why you guys are famous. Like it's so weird. This like double contradiction. Like like who cares if people say this about you? That's your fat sister. People say I'm fat all the time. It's just what it is. I get what she's saying. Like like I get it, but I think she's using. I think don't say it's too much to bear when you continue yeah, to do these shows for twelve thousand seasons. Yeah, you've bared it just fine. You know what I do when I have an unflattering photo? Did you see that one I posted on my TikTok that Moses took of me? <laughs> I post it. I look like the fattest I've ever looked in my life right here. Let me turn down the volume. Nothing will ever top the post the video. Look how kidding. huge I look. Why are you were just like a Quaker? And I posted that. I'm like 250 here. Dude, you look awesome. I look disgusting. You look like Quaker Oats guy. And you know what? I posted it because I'm fat and disgusting at the moment. <laughs> and that's what I'm going to live in. You know, that's my Yo, body. That's what it is. Nothing will ever top the what uh, Quaker Oats. Are you talking about Quaker Oats? Quaker Oats? Qu Qu Quaker Oats. Oatmeal. I don't. Is there a mascot for oatmeal? Here. Yeah, he's like a Quaker. You think my oats. face looks like oatmeal or what? My thighs. Yes, your face, your thighs look like oatmeal. What are you talking about? Wait, Quaker oats <laughs> are why? Why do they? Oh, I wrote quarter oats. <laughs> What's a quarter oat? Why did they come up to all that? Oats. Oh, it's like a location. Here, that's you. Uh. <laughs> You're Quaker oats. You're the Quaker oats guy. That's literally how you're dressed. I don't think so. I had no hair in mine, but yeah, I get. I don't know. No, maybe the hat. I look more. Nothing homage. will ever top the the photo of you as the um. God, I gotta find that. Trisha Paytas, the one that Jason posted of you at when you're at uh, the NFL party. How do you even find it? NFL or something? Maybe NFL party. Maybe just type in NFL. Here, let me see if I can. <laughs> Does it come up? Oh, yeah. it's like a sticker. It's someone selling on Redbubble. Yeah, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Did you put that up there? No, it's so fucking awesome. I posted that myself on Instagram after. I was like, whatever. I thought Jason posted it. No, he did originally, but then I did because I was like, well. <laughs> I mean, that's an unflattering picture, Chloe. Why are you wearing a do-rag and like he a, made me. athletic glasses? He put me in that outfit. <laughs> I don't know why. Ever. Could you imagine if I went on an Instagram and did my Photoshop picture and be like, guys, I'm not, I don't look like that. Like, nobody cares. Yeah, like, exactly. Nobody gives a fuck. Guys, you. I am all body positivity. Except but for me, where I you just, laugh at my Quaker Oats and my double chin. You presented it like I was supposed to laugh at it. What do you want me to cry about you being fat every time you bring it up? There's a TikTok trend where to get rid of your double chin ready. Mm. You just put your tongue at the top of your mouth. Does it work? 
Are you sucking your tongue? Mm-hmm. Okay. But it's not just the tongue, because you end up see. doing this. Yeah. I think it works. It works on you. It works on you, too. Let me see. <laughs> it what do you mean it doesn't well. work? Wait, this? Well, I know it works, but it, but because you, you can tell that you're struggling. Like, not I am. I look natural. No, you both have like a bullfrog effect going on. I'm We're like natural. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What are you talking about? I don't have a double chin. I'm not fat. Don't let the rest of my body get yeah, away. You guys, you guys look great. <laughs> Thank you. Anyways. Anyway, look, I, I get it. But at the same time, it's like. Ugh. She went on like a four page dissertation about that. She was like, and this and this and this. It's like your body is done. It looks good. Your face, you obviously use a shit ton of filter. And that's why I do too. I've been using filter on all my Instagram photos. Go to my latest ones. They're all filter. Have you're you you're so honest about it though. And by the way, I feel like these, these women owe it. To the fucking world to be honest for once about what a natural look body looks that like. that is. Does that look like me? No. It looks like you, but it looks like, you know. Filter. Like, shot. my nose is. Oh, I'm on Moses' Instagram, too, so I always get his comments. I, <laughs> I would post a, um, you should post a fit photo of me like that. All like, Oh, here. You should, here. Do you have the pretty, you don't have the right filter, though. You have to, like, download it out here. Oh, you can do it right now? Yeah. That's the filter you use? Yeah. <gasps> do a cute face, though. Oh my god, you look so I look pretty. like 10 billion times. It makes you all skinny do you want and your like, skin perfect. Yeah, and your do you want like model like you're actually being serious? Oh my god, who is that? Do you have earrings? Exactly. Oh, it's like, ah, big, it makes you have like a send that to, yeah. so that people can see. Okay. Wait, let me take another one. Okay. <laughs> let me try to look ugly in this. Oh my god, this makes you everyone look so beautiful. Okay, well, now it's not catching the film. It even makes my eyes blue. Like, I'm sorry, bitch. Are my brown eyes not good enough for you? <laughs> I'm gonna try to look handsome. So yeah, I look, look like sexy. Here, look at this. Dan, just show it. Now look at this. Why are you getting frustrated? Huh? You just did this. Who? What? Dan. I sent it to him. Yeah. This is great, this is great content. Just taking well, selfies. we'll just send you the photo. <laughs> I'll send Don't it in the to judge that. Okay, I'll send it in the thing. What's up? All right. <laughs> Front of me's group chat is getting a little full. We have a lot of people in the front of me's group chat. But they don't I don't even recognize just, the number. Taking notes. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah, this is uh, We got this document. Did you see this thumbnail? <laughs> what is that you slapped me with? That's it was the goo. Oh. People said we were off that episode. I know. I didn't, I didn't feel that way. Really? Okay, good. Because I felt bad. I was like, was I off to you? No. No. I was like, I don't know. People are tripping. People look into everything like so... I love the comments every episode. Yep, I'm out now. This is the last episode for me. I always see at what? least one of those. Yeah. Oh my god. How We're do you search people. that? How do you search that comment out? Because there's like <laughs> the the response is always like overwhelmingly positive. I just look for the negative in like And then you find one I have never seen a comment like that. I But you must dig like really deep. Anyway, let's let's talk about fuck that person. Let's talk about Chloe. Chloe. So go go on to the next thing. <sighs> Chloe, yeah. Oh, I, I already went to the next one. It says, how about who cares how I f who but who oh poor Chloe. Who cares how she feels? Because she grew up in the life of privilege. I can't read that far, so you have to continue. Stop. Yeah, she says, but who cares how she feels? Now she's in third person. <laughs> she grew up in a life of privilege. She's also on a reality show. She, she, she signed up for all this. I'm, of course, not asking for sympathy, but I am asking to be acknowledged for being a human being. Yeah, I mean, look. But, like, nothing bad happened to her. It was, like, a picture was posted. There was not, like, there's, it's not like she got robbed and everyone's, like, poor rich girl. Like, then people would have sympathy. Like, obviously, no one deserves to be robbed. But it's, like, you said a photo post. Like, like people were saying, parents, my mom posts the most unflattering photos. Like, go to right. my mom's Facebook. It's under Lana Paytas. And they go, like, you're so like, beautiful. Whoa, yeah, it's such a good photo of you. <laughs> That's some bullshit. They have mom eyes, right? But also, it's just normal. Like sometimes I do look fat and ugly, and sometimes I look beautiful, and it's all the same person. It's like that TikTok. That's I like respect you a lot for that. Thank you. That you're willing to show all sides of you. I think that's very important. I just think it's, I, that's why I get really upset about this stuff. Because I think it's so dangerous for like people. I agree. I, 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 I absolutely, I think they're, I think the Kardashians are so fucked because of shit like this. You have yeah. to own this, dude. You have a chance to actually help people like feel okay about in their bodies. Well, that's what happened with Anna Nicole. She said trim spot. She lost all that weight, and there was an uh, there was a minor that like died from it. And that's why they stopped selling trim spot because had like a pedra in it. Spa? Don't you remember she lost all that weight and then she did those commercials for diet pills? It's like Trim Spa Baby. Oh, they were selling like meth, right? It was they, like a Fedra in yeah, it. And it was like, like crazy. Yeah. And so and I was taking it as a kid because you thought, oh, that's how she lost 60 pounds. Holy like, shit. okay. Doesn't that fuck with your head? Like, oh, I'm sure high? it did. I'm cool. sure it did. I was so fucked up from it. And I, I did lose like a bunch of weight, but I 
think a couple people died from it. They were selling that on TV? In the store. You could go to CVS. That's, like a tar- Yeah. Whoa. And dude, the, dude, the but world then, used to be so wild. World, where it has it. Like, she also did. I mean, you have to work hard. Like, if you get liposuction, it's not like you just lose weight. But she did get help. And if people don't say it, like, people end up dying trying to look like you. Like, it's fucking crazy. Yeah. Because they used to peddle diet pills. They used to do quick yeah, slim. And point. so, it's like, you're you're just promoting it's such a good falsehood. Point. It's a great it's a great point. And you can have lipo and still be healthy. You can like work out. I'm someone who had lipo and didn't work out and not healthy. So there's like two different lipo people. Those who continue to be a fat ass but after like lipo. Kim, Kim Kardashian, she can't just walk around like with this fucking ass the size of a <laughs> the size of like a locomotive and like the ti- the tiniest waist and like yeah. huge boobs. And her body just looks like so freakish. Like yeah. no body looks like that naturally. No, like, you, you need have to be to honest have. about that. I know. I don't understand why people aren't either. She says, blah, blah, blah. She just keeps whining. Shut up. Nobody cares. It's so, <laughs> that's literally what she said in her like, thing. Like, literally, nobody gives a fuck. Like, nothing bad happened to you. It's like you said. It's like, mm-hmm. okay, I have empathy and yada, but it's like, nothing happened to you. Your Nana posted a fucking picture of you and, like, get over it. Yeah. And everybody's insecure and everyone deals with it and everyone signs up for it. That's just life. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know what else to say. I really want to show the photo. I no. <laughs> it's not worth killing with it. Yeah, I mean, if she's, like, that traumatized by it, but if that's the case, then she needs to get off reality TV and social media altogether and maybe just see a therapist for a little while if you're that traumatized by it. Like, damn, girl, you she look see, good. She, she sees her therapist at the same time as her plastic surgeon. They they, <laughs> they meet together. <laughs> That'd be good. and convenient time saver. Exactly. It's like shampoo and conditioner. Here, so here's someone, a <gasps> plastic surgery consultant, just to give you an idea of what they're doing. On Twitter, they're locking accounts that are posting the photo. Wait, what? On what? On Twitter? Yeah, on Twitter. Oh my god! Like they are on an all-out war. Like if she that's has real? fleets of attorneys sending out DMCA's. Oh my god! There's literally people like dying, <laughs> like, and they're like, "Let's take this out." Like, why don't you use that lawyer to like help? Like, you know, huh? Isn't that's that, a line from that the a line from the yeah. Kardashians. There's what people you just dying. Oh yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> well, there. Were-